Hello, my name is Raghu Das and I'm here at the ID Tech X show in Berlin. I'm currently at the booth of APS Solutions. Hello Olaf, thank you very much for coming. Hello. Tell us a bit about your company and uh, what you do. So we are a small company distributing different things to compact um, semiconductor products. So from, uh, yeah, probe cards, sockets, also equipment like probe stations. Right. It's a very small one. Affordable. So, so what sort of applications is used? Um, that's used to com to compact uh, like chip chips or compacts, very small ones. You can see you have here so uh, the needles. Yeah. So that's just for demonstration. Yeah. To to demonstrate the, the size, how we can use it. So it comes with a little microscope camera. You can see here that's. One millimeter. Oh, okay. okay. And then you can here move needles. So, and then if you if you see, it's back and forth. So, and then it's also in all three directions. Right. Movable. And so you can compact on wafers, on chips. Right. So that's the smallest station. Yeah. And then you it, use fits, it fits in that box. Okay. <laughs> and you use this to test for tests. ICs? Okay. For test for more laboratory things. Okay. So that's the smallest one. It goes up to 12 inch. Right. Right. So and uh, so different applications. Then we have. And what sort of industries buy this equipment? Um, that's usually uh, from institutes, universities, up to also big uh, semiconductor companies for their laboratories. Right. right. So there are different things. So we have uh, so like here it's uh, we have like an uh, probe station for screens. So it's like the screen here and the little contacts move like a bridge over that and you can a test probe yeah. everywhere, or you can like here yeah, cryogenic probe station filled with uh, liquid nitrogen going down to 196 oh, okay. minus 196 Celsius. The Thank you. Yeah. So moving on to this yes. machine over here, can you tell us a bit about this? This uh, is a thermal forcing system, so it uses direct contact to your device. You need to test at different uh, temperatures. So uh, it goes from like minus 55 to this one to plus 155. So that's the smallest of mm. that group. It's made by McCabell devices in Israel. This plunger is tailor-made for your application. Yeah. Depending on the size you need. So there are also bigger stations, uh, bigger thermal forcing systems available depending on the power consumption of your device. So if you have like a power device uh, for electric car, uh, you need to make sure to test it like at minus 40. Right. And it has to stay at minus 40 even if it's full powered. Right. So the power of this depends on your application. And that's also lots of laboratory use it because it's small, it's movable. And the other ones get a bit bigger. Yeah, it's it's for thermal tests and right. different kinds. Yeah, and we have also some things like yeah, let's have a look at our products. So we have also like the handling, like pick and plates handlers and gra smaller gravity handlers. Uh, then we got our equipment. We got different sockets for like housed devices, right. usually e uh, either in productive test or also a lot of like uh, failure analysis and, and stuff like that. And being a, a reseller of these solutions, yes. uh, do you mainly focus in Germany or how big is the territory you look at? Um, it's different on the product range. So mm. it's like we have uh, for some companies, we are just supplier for the German speaking market. Mm -hmm. And for other, we are like Paul of Europe and also Israel. Okay. So it's like uh, we also distribute probe cards and even a repair station for that. Yeah, it's quite a portfolio. Fantastic. Yeah, very interesting. We have. Thank you very much, Olaf. Thank you. Thanks.